We are uh, back with uh, Steve Angelo versus Ray Scarface, and of course I missed a few turns again, so we will rewatch. Looks pretty similar to a team that Ray Scarface has used in SPL. Yeah, I think it's like I think it's exactly the same team. Yeah, exact same team. Yeah, we see it's a protein Greninja that goes for Ice Beam on Landers turn one. Steve Angelo not wanting to over predict. Tapofini probably just gonna scout for the gunk shot here going to Magnazone. So yeah, Landros was a pretty great play there. And he can get up his rocks. And I know this is a uh, rocks Z move Landros, I think. My version of the team I use this team, I use Scarf Rocks jumps, but it wasn't necessary. It's probably not the best idea. But yeah, Continental Crush does a lot to the opposing Landros. And his Lando gets 3 KO'd. The thing is, he kind of has the diva letter for his princess, so... I assume we're gonna see Giga Drain from the Tangles here, not wanting to let the Medichim come in for free. But he just goes for HPIs. Medichim basically gets a kill now. High Jump Kick blows this away. Wait, that did nothing. I forgot that it's fifth death Tangles on this team. As he dodges the Sleep Powder, which sucks. Okay, they already said GG, so I think Ray got hexed. Yeah, I have to make, pay more attention to smoke this. I was working on a thumbnail for another game, and this game <laughs> was at turn 11 when I, when I realized it started, and like, it's pretty much already over. But yeah, still, I can go for heavy slam predicting a taunt here. As he goes for leech here, okay. Natchez Man is probably gonna come out. Okay, Moonblast, that's weird. Maybe predicting some sort of hard some sort of switch. He flames through predicting the Magnus on there. Natchez Madness comes out now. I assume he's gonna go Magnus on now. Cause last time he didn't. Exactly. Gets leech seated and this has protect, which uh, pretty much every stealer has, defensive set at least. It's pretty annoying for Ray. I think this is AV Magnezone. Yeah, that, that, that didn't do that much. Oh. Actually, 60% is decent damage. I'm not sure anymore. So maybe this is fifth death stealer, or maybe there was Specs Magnezone if it's fifth death stealer. But he is gonna pivot back into Magnuson predicting protect. Yes, Steve Angelo makes a good play, double leech seeding. Yeah, these games are just like these videos are just super short then, cause I like missed the games from the beginning. But I I didn't expect Ray Scarface to play. So he tries to go for the double protect there. Magnuson picks up the kill, but Medicham comes back and gets a kill now. Like Fini would get to it killed if it doesn't get O code. Yeah, like, you can go for T-Punch. Yep. But yeah, the, the sleep powder miss earlier was annoying. I completely forgot that it's Helmet Tangles. I, s I don't know if Manos is still allowed this week. This week Manos is probably still allowed in this tour, so it makes sense that he's Helmet on Tang. And yeah, the Coco is gonna go for U turn a Volt Switch. Oh, he goes for T-Volt, okay. That 2 it kills, yeah, I forgot it's not AV, so that just 2 it kills the Tangles. Heavy zone is a check for Coco on this team, he gets a crit. Yeah, so we're gonna see a T-Bolt or Flash can T-Bolt probably. Picks off the Azu. Wow, this is close. As Greninja, um I don't know if I would have gone hard pincer. Yeah, it goes for Crooked Deck to get some chip damage off. We see his life of Greninja, not not uh, Expert Belt. Uh, Expert Belt is like kind of cool with spike support because you don't get worn down. So he goes Magnuson on the gunk, but this doesn't do anything. He just gets more regen. HP Fire just gets a kill here, I think. Like Tangles might live one, but it should do a lot. Yeah, it kills. And yeah, this dies to HP Fire and Steve Angelo wins 2-0. Said sorry for the miss. I don't know which turn they're about talking about if you click EQ. Oh, 
On the turn that he gunk shotted with the Greninja, like talking about EQ with Tangles? No. No, they're not talking about that. I don't think this Tangles runs EQ. It's Sleep Powder, Hidden Power. Knock off Giga Drain. But yeah, Steve Angelo takes the win. I think he is doing pretty well. He's 3 and 0, if I recall correctly, in this uh, overused Premier League. Last week he brought Baton Pass, week one he brought some Curse Pass into Sableye or into Blissey. Uh, to Common Sableye, I don't remember if it was Common Blissey. And he got hexed a bit, but he still won. I don't remember if his opponent joke. Yeah, the the NJMP ninjas are doing pretty well. I'm not gonna spot. I just get this money with this Croven game that I just uploaded. But yeah, they're two and zero oh if you only count this game. And I don't know if any other games are played yet, because sometimes the schedule here, um, like the score here, doesn't update sometimes, because there might have been more games played. Yeah, thank you guys for watching, and <laughs> I'll do my best to like get the next game from turn one. Oh yeah, especially the Ricardo was top tier. Boy, but I have a specific time. I know when that game is happening, so I won't miss that. I'll make sure that I won't miss that from the start. Peace out.